Several years ago I was invited into a primary school to show some year one and two classes how to make uh, pinwheels, uh, pin windmills like this. Uh, it didn't go very well because uh, although they were able to cut out a square of paper and then cut the diagonals to start to form the blades, they found um, actually assembling it, knocking the nail through and putting a spacer there um, using a hammer, knocking the nail into a piece of wood, extremely difficult and um, I, I had to give them lots of help. So um, I've come up with a, um, an easier design which um, they're able to make the whole thing. Um, for it you need um, a square of paper. Actually I'm using uh, a very thin card. It just makes the windmill a little bit more robust. Um, older children they can actually start to draw the windmill themselves. They need to draw two diagonals this I'm sure you've you've done this before made windmills there we go and we make make a hole in the middle uh, again I'm using a sharp pencil and a sponge block just push through a hole um, for the holes for the outside holes uh, I'm going to use a hole punch. If you don't have a hole punch, you can use the sharp pencil again. And we make a hole on the right hand side, every time on the right hand side of each of the four corners. Let's pull that bit out. And there's the last one. And then we cut along the diagonals, but stop about two or three centimetres from the centre. This um, square of card is about uh, 12 centimetres square. Um, what, sometimes when I work in schools uh, I, I come in with some pre-printed sheets which uh, they can then cut out um, and then uh, they bring it to me and I punch the holes out for them. Okay, next thing we're going to do is uh, we're going to start to um, assemble the windmill and to do this we need a plastic bendy straw. Um, the part we need is not the bendy part, we just need the straight part of the bendy straw. So we'll just cut that off. And we're going to use these small bits of plastic tubing. This is flexible plastic tubing. You can get this in um, pet shops, um, aquarium shops, or science suppliers. Um, this is this is uh, about six or seven millimeters outside diameter. And what I do is I cut a piece off about one centimeter, and then cut up to slit it like that so that it can be easily slid on to the piece of bendy straw like that and um, when I go into a school I have um, dozens and dozens of these all already made so we get one of these collars slide it onto the piece of bendy straw slide it down and now we can start to um, assemble uh, our windmill we push through the centre hole like this and then bring the first blade down, oops, the first one, then the next one, there it goes, then the next one. And then the last one. And to fix it in place, we're going to slide another collar on onto there, so that the pin mill is secured in place. Now, to make your uh, windmill turn really freely, we're going to run that bendy straw in a piece of plastic jumbo straw. Uh, conveniently, that fits inside, and you can see it's already beginning to 
to move. Um, to make a handle, we're going to use another bendy straw and we're going to sellotape a piece of jumbo straw on top of it. So I'm going to cut the jumbo straw in half and I'm going to stick the piece of jumbo straw on top of the bendy straw. We just need a piece of sticky tape, wrap it round. That piece of jumbo straw is a little bit too long, I'm going to cut it back just to leave it a little bit sticking out at the front and a bit sticking out at the back. That's to make sure that the windmill doesn't rub on the on the handle. So now we can slide our assembled windmill into there. You can see it's already going. Um, to stop it falling out we can put another collar on the back of the bendy straw to stop it from falling out. Don't push it up, leave a gap to make sure it's able to turn. And you can see that um, that's working really well. Um, if you want to you can make a, a stand for your windmill. I've just used a wooden wheel and a piece of 5mm dowel and obviously uh, the children can colour in their windmills as well.